Little, you know, issue after last night's game. You, Mitch Robinson went on the Snapchat. I don't know if he's joking or being serious, but was was talking about the fact that he didn't like just going out there for 48 minutes of cardio. He wants more role in the offense. He wants to be involved a little bit more. What, what do you think about that? What's been your takes on Mitch and, and uh, the lack of offense? I agree with that sentiment based on what we're paying him. You know, like, and we're not paying him an, an astronomical amount of bread, but he does have a nice little contract and he's committed to us for four more years. I don't like when I go on the box score and I see he's got, you know, four points and, and five rebounds, you know, getting 15 or whatever per year for that. I mean, <laughs> what are we doing? You know what mm -hmm. I mean? So, you know, I, I need my center to go out there and give me a double-double every night. You know, Shaq had a saying once, and it's, it's going to be different for Mitch because the offense isn't going to run through him right. with this roster, but... Shaq had a saying like, yo, I just need seven points a quarter. If you break it down like that, I get seven points a quarter. I'm getting 28 a night. I'm good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm looking at Mitch like, yo, just go get four or five points a quarter. Get your 16, 20 points a night. Give me nine rebounds. No one's going to complain. You're probably going to be an all-star. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. you know, go out there and, and you know, I, I need more than four points from Mitch. But then I look at the amount of shots he's taking and it's like one for three. And I'm like, well, I can't even be that mad at him if he only took three shots. Right. So I just, I need a little bit more emphasis on that. Take advantage of it. You know, if Julius is getting doubled, Jalen Brunson is getting doubled, take advantage of it. But that's where I come back with the assist with, with Jalen. I like Jalen Brunson a lot. Mm. I bought that jersey the first day they made it for sale, baby. <laughs> I wore it on tour in Switzerland, baby, first yeah. night. Yeah. But um, I need seven, eight assists from Jalen, man. That lane is packed. We know you get busy, baby. We know you can break down traffic. You'll weave that rock around and let Mitchell get two right there. You know what I mean? And, yeah. and, and, and we can all eat the right way. I, I agree with you on that. I think it's a combination of... They, sh they should be looking for him a little bit more, especially in the pick and roll. Take advantage of, yeah. of his vertical spacing. He needs to do a better job of, of screening. But but I do think the guards need to do a better job of finding him because who wants to play a 48-minute a 48 game, 48 minute game where you're just sitting there on defense and running up and down the court? I so I think, I, it, I think it continues to help with the chemistry, with the cohesion. If, just get him involved, throw him, throw him a little touchdown low if he, if he has a smaller uh, uh, matchup on a mismatch. Absolutely. Let him get Take activated. Yeah, see what's, see, see what's going on there. Um, but I think yeah. for Mitch also, number one, he's got to make his free throws. That's for one. Yeah. You know, make yeah. your free throws when they free at the charity stripe. That'll help you get some of those points. And also when he's around the rim, last year it seemed like he, he, had, a, he had an easier time putting things back you know put getting putbacks for them this year right. he, he's, his hands have kind of been a little bit loosey-goosey man so i think yeah. he's got to tighten up there but i would like to see them find him a little bit more as well get him in, yeah. involved absolutely